Hey, it's Andrew Brown from Exam Pro, and we are taking a look at the AWS Snow family. So this is storage and compute devices used to physically move data in or out of the cloud when moving data over the internet or provide private connection that is too slow, difficult, or costly. So we have Snow Cone, Snowball Edge, and Snowmobile. And so there originally was just Snowball, and then they came out with Snowball Edge, uh, and Edge introduced Edge Computing. That's why there's Edge in the name. Uh, but pretty much all of these devices have edge computing uh, and they do individually come with some variants. So with the Snowball, uh, Snow Cone, it comes in two sizes where it has eight terabytes of usable storage. And then there's one with 14 terabytes of usable storage. For Snowball Edge, it technically has like four versions, but I'm gonna break it down to two for you. We have Storage Optimize where we have 80 terabytes of, use, um, uh, of uh, usable storage there. And then Compute Optimize 30.9 0.5 terabytes. And even though it's not here, you get a lot of vCPUs and increased memory, which could be very important if you need to do edge computing before you send that over to AWS. And then last here we have Snowmobile, which can uh, store up to 100 uh, petabytes of storage. Um, in the uh, associates, I cover these in a lot more detail because there's so much more about these, like the security of them, how they're tamper-proof, something like how they have networking built in, the, the connection to them. But you know, for this exam, that's just too much information. Um, but you just need to know that there are three, uh, three ones in the family and generally what the sizes are and that they're gonna be all placed into Amazon S3. Uh, what's interesting is that you know the snowmobile only does 100 petabytes, but uh, AWS markets it as you can move exabytes of of um, content because you can order more than one of these devices. So uh, they'll market it saying like Snowball Edge is when you want to move uh, petabytes of data, and Snowball Mobile is when you want to move exabytes. But you can see that a single thing isn't in the exabytes, it's just in the petabyte. Okay.